Good afternoon, everyone. We hope you guys are having a happy Monday. My name is Kristen, and I'm the Education Director for Sea Turtle Inc. Sea Turtle Inc. is a nonprofit sea turtle hospital located on South Padre Island, Texas. We have a three-tier mission to rescue and rehabilitate sick and injured sea turtles for release back out into the wild, to educate the public, as well as work towards conservation efforts for all marine turtle species. So I see some of you are hopping on already. Go ahead and type into the comments where you guys are tuning in from. We have a special treat for you guys today. I know that the internet wasn't working well for us for our release yesterday. So we are back out here um, at the flats and we are gonna be releasing some of our green sea turtle patients. So we're really excited. A lot of these turtles are ready to go back out into the wild. So I'm gonna spin the camera. So you guys can see two of our staff members here, Deonda and Sam, and they have two of our green sea turtle patients. Both of these patients washed up on March 5th. Um, one of them is Penguin, and Penguin was stuck in the rocks at the jetties. And then we also have Moose that washed up um, by County Access 6. So we're really excited that these turtles are ready to get released back out into the wild. They are both green sea turtles. So I'm gonna try and show you guys here. There's a lot of seagrass that we're standing in right now. This is the green sea turtle's primary source of food. And the Laguna Madre is a foraging ground for juvenile green sea turtles. So we're really excited to get these turtles back out into the wild. If you guys have any questions, go ahead and put them into the uh, comment section and I'll answer them as I see them pop up. <laughs> no, the other way. So sometimes it does take a minute for the turtles to kind of gather where they are. So you'll see both of them swimming in different directions here. Oh, he just took a little breath. So I see people tuning in from all over. This is always a fast Facebook Live when we're out here at the flats and a quick release. But if you guys do have questions, go ahead and put them into the chat. Both of the turtles have been released now. You guys will see two of our rehab staff over here. They always wait for a final breath for them to poke their heads up like you guys saw the turtle over here do. And then they are usually on their way swimming out into the Laguna Madre. <laughs> so both of the turtles have been released. They both took their goodbye breath and out into the wild they are. So I'm going to spin the camera around. Again, that was a super fast Facebook Live. Um, we hope you guys w enjoyed watching those turtles return back out into the ocean. We do still have a lot of sea turtles in our hospital. So if you guys are interested in supporting their care, we will put the link to our adoptions in the description of this video. Feel free to go visit our website to learn about all of our sea turtles that we still have rehabilitating at our facility. I see a question coming in from Tom. How long do sea turtles live? They ha typically have about a human lifespan, so they will live to be over over 60 years old. Green sea turtles like you guys just saw get released. Um, they can live to be up to 100 years old, sometimes longer than that. Um, Sherry's question, what species? The turtles that just got released were Atlantic green sea turtles. So primarily green sea turtles are the main species that we get in our hospital because this area is a foraging ground for them. So they migrate here primarily from Mexico, but from other locations too. All right, so I'm not seeing any more questions. I did see you guys tuning in from all over. We had people from Texas, Mexico, New York. I see New Jersey in there. Uh, somebody's saying hi to our intern, Will. Uh, let's see who else. Oh, Justice is asking, how did Penguin and Moose get their names? So all of the turtles at our facility are named, and those names actually come from the people that find them. So one thing to keep in mind, if you guys do come visit South Padre Island, if you stumble across a turtle that needs our help, we ask that you call us, and we'll come out and pick that turtle up. But while you're waiting for us to come out and meet you, you guys can think of an awesome name for these turtles, too. Uh, we are also in nesting season. We haven't had our first um, nesting turtle on South Padre Island yet, but if you guys do come to the island, make sure you guys are keeping your eyes peeled because we should have one um, hopefully any day now. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and end this live. Thank you guys so much. If there are more questions, feel free to put them in the comments and we will answer them when we get back onto our system tomorrow. Thank you guys so much and I hope you have an awesome rest of your week. Bye guys.